Maniac number one. Robert is at home because it's Saturday. I thought I would just do a quick hi. Um, I don't know how much. Yeah, I've got. Oh, good. Okay. I thought I was going to run out of memory. It's hard now because Robert's on the computer a lot during the day. And so he's usually on the computer when I need it for recording. But I'm kind of excited because today we're going to go over and see Sahara with our computer and she's going to show us how to do some extra um, recording stuff, like having the little picture of yourself in the corner while you do stuff on the computer kind of thing. So that's something that Robert's been really wanting to do with uh, some of the games that he plays during the day. So we decided we were going to try to grow his channel while he's on leave like this so hopefully today we're gonna have that knowledge and Mike Robert's gonna learn it and he can get going on his channel and once he does I will definitely uh, put a link in my channel our channel so that you guys can see his channel if you're a gamer or interested at all his big favorite game is magic so that's normally what he plays is magic but who knows if he starts to really do this he may do all kinds you never know but Magic is his favorite game. Magic the Gathering, if you don't already know. So, I've been thinking a lot, and, you know, if you've been watching my channel at all, you know that we're having a little bit of a sugar problem right now. And, um, the addiction is definitely alive and kicking. So, what I'd really like to do is this weekend, I'd like to have a no sugar weekend. But, Tuesday... Is Robert and I's anniversary, 25 years of marriage. So it's kind of a big one. So I don't know if we're gonna try to do something fun or what. You know, with his foot the way it is and being in a boot, there's not a lot of action we can do. And I mean, we like going to movies, but I don't know necessarily that he's gonna want to go see a movie. But he made a bunch of brisket. So we, we're probably gonna have brisket all week. Hopefully. Um, but other than that, I don't know what we're going to do. We have an um, oil for an oil change that we might do. I don't know. There's lots of things that are options. Right now I'm going to work, and then we're going to do the farmer's market, and then we're going to go to Sahara's. And that's all I know so far. Um, we did, uh, on, on Friday for workout, we did what's called Dirty 30. And it's a workout from Beachbody. I think the girl's name is Autumn. I don't know where her last name is. But it's very full body. So today I'm feeling rather sore. Especially my butt. Butt is very sore. The muscles. So. I'm not like dying to run or anything. My butt is sore. Uh, Robert pulled the plug on the pool. So our goal this weekend, I know for sure, is to um, get the pool cleaned up. And we, somebody gave us a, um, a trampoline. And so we, we started to put it together and we put it together incorrectly. And now, unfortunately, that means that we have to like hammer it apart to put it back together. So that's something I'd like to do this weekend, but We'll see. We'll see how we're feeling. And it's it's rainy and you know because of the hurricane and stuff that's coming in, it could continue to stay rainy, so I don't know. Um I need a sledgehammer. I think it's a sledgehammer. If I'm gonna do that, the ones with a weighted end. Can't think of what the name for. Um, you know, probably you said it in your head just now. That thing. So I need one of those to um, to get the trampoline apart. And if I can do that, then we can put it back together. It was kind of funny because when it was when we were putting it together, I was like, "This isn't right. This isn't right." And I did not know even for a minute that it was going to be this hard to take it back apart. Or I would have been like, "Stop right now. Let's fix this first. You know, hindsight and all that. So. Now we're trying to figure out how to get it back apart so that we can put it back together correctly. 
blind leading the blind sometimes, you know? So we had we had cake um, for a party. Our, our bosses gave us an appreciation party. And of course, because I'm still having trouble with sugar, I had some. So that's what I mean, is there's, there's too many options for me right now around me that I can have sugar that I just really have to figure out how to break the sugar addiction. So, and all, to me, the only option is to just stop eating sugar. So I need to, I need to push and I need to suffer through not having it, if at all humanly possible. I don't like being on this side of a sugar addiction. It's really tough. I don't like it. <sighs> Anywho, I'm going to go to work. I'm going to try to get some stuff done. I'm probably going to end up having to take some ibuprofen. Woo. My husband's calling me. All right, we'll talk to y'all later.